This is for Libra, sub rising and Venus signs. For Libra, sub rising and Venus signs. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. I do appreciate all my Libras out here. You do have somebody from the past that has something they want to say to Libra right now. We have, I wish things could be different. This is a fire sign for a lot of you. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I left you before you could leave me. So for a lot of my Libras, this person did walk away because they felt like you were going to walk away or they felt like you were entertaining other people or getting to know somebody else. So they kind of felt like they were matching your energy and re in reality, they sabotaged the situation. We have, I know I was a distraction from your pain. I hope that one day you could forgive me. Uh, this is a Aries. This could be a Leo. I'm getting some earth energy. Could be a Capricorn, Virgo. I regret lying to you. Yes, they did lie to you, Libra. It's like they called itself lying to you to prevent from hurting your feelings. But in reality, they just had some narcissist energy and just couldn't keep it real with you. We have, I'm becoming a better person. So I'm getting in the midst of you and this person not really together. And it's been a couple weeks for some of you, a couple months, a couple years for others. This person's been working on their self. At least they're telling their self that. We will be together again. They're wanting a reconciliation with Libra. I don't know if Libra wants this or not, but my life is not together as it seems. Yeah, Libra, you looked at this person with like emperor energy or high priestess. Like you really look up to this person and was really inspired by them at one point. Now you don't give a fuck and you're not really stunting them, but I'm getting at one point you definitely were inspired. We have, I feel you leaving me behind. So this person knows that Libra's mentally done with them. They crossed a lot of lines with you. I know I crossed that line with you, so they're acknowledging that. I will wait for a sign from you. It's almost like they're waiting for like that Batman signal to approach Libra, but little do they know Libra likes boldness. You gotta be bold. They're not gonna make it easy for you, you know? We have to take a break. Life is working out a season, get off the treadmill. So for a lot of my Libras, especially for my Libras that are just going so hard and not really giving themselves time to, you know, just breathe a little bit. Some of you even working two, three jobs. We got the awakening. We got something new happening for Libra. We got a new path opening up for Libra. Okay. Dance with life. Do something to change your energy. So for a lot of my Libras, especially for those of you that's having financial hardships or relationship problems, just whatever. Maybe you're even tired of being single and ready for a man or ready for a woman. Do something to change your energy. Even if you just got to get up and dance to your favorite song, you know, your vibrations are rising. Be careful of the company that you're keeping. Energies do transfer. If you hang around miserable friends and talk to miserable people, you will start to feel their energy. Don't dim your light to fit in, Libra, even if it involves leaving others behind. I do appreciate all my Libras out here. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. Thank you. A lot of our Libras are using that talent for work and to make money in different ways. I'm a fellow Libra myself, for those of you that didn't know. We got empowerment. So for a lot of my Libras, I'm seeing you feeling empowered. I'm seeing you feeling inspired. I'm seeing you feel strong. I'm seeing you ready to go after something. I'm seeing you set boundaries as well. I'm getting that's where a lot of my Libras are at mentally. You're not letting people cross those lines. You're setting a whole fire. Nobody's running across a fire, not unless they want to get burned. You know, so nobody's going to cross those boundaries. Libra has made boundaries that are impossible to reach. And I think that's to protect your heart. I'm seeing a lot of you feel free now, especially for those of you that are single and just got out of a situation. The future energy coming in for Libra is closure. Closure is coming in for Libra. What other future energies are coming in for Libra? We got the devil. So be careful of somebody's intention, Libra. Be careful with somebody around you. We got a Libra that's like a designer or a fat, um, maybe you could just be a fashionista, getting a lot of different energies. Be careful, we do got change coming in. Yeah, somebody, this could even be somebody that you work with for some of my Libras. So take what energy resonates and Libra does it for somebody else. Somebody can have a two-year-old. Yeah, we got the death card. Something's coming to an end. So we do have the devil and we do have the death card. For some of you, this might actually be a good thing. Maybe this is the end to a toxic relationship or maybe a job or maybe even a friendship. I'm getting a lot of different situations. Or maybe you're leaving a family member in the past and realizing you can't help this family member no more because we all got those kind of family members. We got abundance coming in for Libra. This is the, the future energy that's set for Libra. 
This is what Libra's been manifesting. This is what Libra's really wanting right now. I am still doing five for five questions for Libra. The cash app is D E E F O N D E L. I am still doing quick email readers for 10. You can call me right now for 30. Five is going to be the lucky number for Libra. Somebody regrets what they did to Libra. Somebody can have a three year old. This is the current energy for Libra. We do have the Hermit. I'm seeing a lot of you not making any fast moves right now, being observant, being smart. I appreciate all my Libras. Thank you.